viewers. Today I have something very different from the normal houses I always show you. The modern houses, not today. Today I have a mud house. And I want to show you how mud houses are always smeared. What this lady is doing, it is called smearing. And she is smearing the outside part of the walls of this mud house. She has gone all round and she's now doing the last touches or the last part of the house. This is a kitchen that normally people will build houses but will not place kitchen inside the house. They will place the kitchen outside the house because they cook with firewood. So this is what happens in the village and smearing is done by women. There are those women who just have this art of smearing. I lived in a mud house, but I didn't know how to do this smearing. So they are just women who can do this work. This lady has been hired to do this work. Those women who know how to smear, people will hire them to come and smear their houses. She is supposed to smear the outside part and even the inside part of the kitchen area. This is an outside kitchen area just the way I have told you before. You see that brighter part is the one which is remaining now. And normally the smearing will be done just like, uh, let me say that you have painted your house and you feel like you want to paint it again. Because this is a house that had been smeared, but the owner wanted it to be smeared again. And normally rain sometimes will wash it out and people will do the smearing maybe once in a year. Let us now see the other parts that she has smeared. This is the back side of the kitchen that she has already smeared and it is still wet. It's still wet. When it dries up, it will be a bit brighter than this. But this one is still wet. And then this is the side of the kitchen. We just go around and see how she's done the work. And she's done all this work on her own. She's done all this work on her own. She will be coming back to do the inside and even the floor is also going to be smeared. Okay. This is another side. And that is a kitchen. That's a window. That's a window of the kitchen. That's a window of the kitchen. Okay. There's something here I want you to see. I was so much amused on this part. You know, I just, I was like, just passing by and I saw something very interesting and I decided to come by and take these pictures. It's like that place there is a bit higher and she is trying to contemplate of how she's going to reach somewhere there and she wants to use that stool. She's a lady, there's no ladder to go up there. So she's trying to use the stool to see how she's going to place that stool so that she can get up somewhere there. I didn't see the other parts how she did it because I found when she's nearly finishing the, the kitchen. Let's see just how she's going to do it. I'm very much curious to see, is she really going to manage to do that? You know, there's no ladder and she wants to use the stool. And I think since this stool is here, maybe that is what, okay, she's up there now. She's up there and she is smearing that part. 
She has climbed that stool. Let us just see. Is she going to complete the place? You see how she's doing with her hands? And you know, it is just mud, cow dung, and water being mixed together. And then it is like being smoothened up. To me, I call it art. Because not everybody can do this. It's just an art that most of the women do in the rural area. There she is. She has not completed. There's a part that she has not completed. And she's now doing, seeing how she can go up there with that stool again. You can see how she's looking at that place. Okay, she's climbing. She's climbing. Okay, she's up there. Okay, she's doing it. She's doing it. That's nice. Okay, at least she's going to complete it. I want to see if she's going to complete that upper part there. Is she going to reach there? And you know, okay, she has done it. Well done. She has done it. This is where she was making the mixture. It was just soil mixed with cow dung and water. And she did all this by herself. Now, this is the main house of that kitchen. And that is why they do a kitchen outside so that they cook with firewood. You can see it's, it is just adjacent to each other. There is this main house and that, was, that is the kitchen. So they will cook outside there with firewood. And this is the main house now. I don't know whether this one also will be smeared. But this is how it looks like. It's just a mud house. And then it is smeared. Now this is the side of the main house. I think they're going to do this. You can see rain has washed part of it. And that is why they smear, the smearing will be done nearly every year. And especially now, there's a lot of rain. Okay, this is the backside. And down there, you can see the effect of rain washing it out. This is the backside of the house. And you can see part of the kitchen somewhere there. Okay. Now, I wanted us just to go. It's still the main house. I want to see the inside of the house. It's not a big house. It's just like having a sitting room and a bedroom just beside it. This is the living room of that house. And you can see on the walls, they've placed these shears to cover the smearing or the wall not to be seen so much. So they've covered the wall with the shears. Now that's a curtain now going to the other side of the bedroom. I didn't go there. This is still the living room of the mud house. Let's just go around and you see how it looks. You can see they have an entertainment area there. There's a TV there. And now this is the roof, how it looks like. And they even have electricity around. That is the roof. Inside the house, that is. And I saw like there was a carpet. This was a rug. Let me say a rug inside the living room. Okay, viewers, that is enough for today. If you like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and kindly subscribe to my channel. And let's meet on the next.